Welcome to another day here in the beautiful Isle of Mark. Well, today we're gonna play some games, guys. Uh, so this game is called X and O's. Have you ever played X and O's? So, I just made a X and O's thing here. What is that? Well, actually it looks like a hashtag like you use on Twitter and Instagram. Well, it's not a hashtag, it's a game, okay? It's called X and O's. So, uh, I guess I'm just playing with myself. I guess I'll start with, I'll start with X's. Does X, X's always start? Does X always start? I don't know, I haven't played for a long time. I'm all alone. Oh, better not lose my balance. Yeah, I don't know, I, I haven't played X and O's for a long time. Can't remember the rules, but um, the idea is to get three, three in a row. Okay, the rows can be like vertical, you can have a row this way, or a, a horizontal row like that, or a diagonal. Okay, you can't go like, you can't have like an L. Okay, so the idea is to get three in a row. So three X, X's against those. Okay, so I'm gonna play with myself here. So let's put an X right here. Okay, next is the O's. So I'll put an O right here. All right, now it's X's turn again. We're gonna put an X over here. And uh, I'll put an O here to block, to block the win. Ooh, now it's X's turn. Okay, so X has to put an X here to block the win that way. Now it's O's turn. O will go here. Oh, now X has to play defense again. Block the win here. And O will go, oops. O will go here. And X only has one spot left. Oh no. It's a cat's game. It's a cat's game. It means it's a tie, nobody won. Have you ever heard that before? A cat's game, that means a tie. But you know, I think that only, we only use that term for X and O's. Maybe we use it for some other games, I'm not sure. But the only thing I can think of is, uh, is X and O's. I don't think, you can't use it for, I don't think you can use it for sports. Um, you can't use it for other games like board games or card games. I think it's just for X and O's. So, um, what other games should we play? Let's play Hangman. Let's play Hangman. Okay, so, first we'll draw the, we'll draw the, whatever it's called. I don't know, the waves are, waves are getting a bit close. Hopefully the waves don't uh, wipe out. What's this called? Can't remember what that's called in English. The the hang the hangman. The uh, not the noose. Okay, the noose is the part that goes around the neck. Okay, like the noose is like the noose is the rope. Well, I built it too close to the ocean. Let's go over here. Well, back up a few paces. Paces means like. Steps, no, not like, 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 look, this is a pace, okay? I'm pacing. Okay, a pace is like, I don't know, one meter, less than a meter, that's a, a pace, okay? Uh, so we need to find a, we need to find a, a fresh bit of sand where I haven't walked, I've walked all over my island. So let's go over here to find a, to find a clean patch of Sand. Ooh, look at this nice sand over here. Okay, we found the perfect game board here. Okay, so. Oh no, I just messed up the sand by walking in it. Okay, so we're gonna draw ourselves this thing again. Okay, 
Here's our word, okay? It's gonna have four letters. Four letters, okay, take your guess. Do you want a vowel or a consonant? What are the vowels in English? A, E, I, O, U, right? And sometimes Y. So, do you want to pick a vowel or a consonant? What's that? You want to pick a vowel? Okay, you pick an E? Nope. All right. All right, there's his head. <laughs> okay. Uh, what's your next pick? F? A terrible pick. There's no F. You get a neck. Okay. What's your next pick? A. Ooh, that's a good pick. There's an A right here. A. Alright, what's your next pick? X? Who are you guys? This isn't Chinese. This is English. We speak English here on the Isle of Mark. There's no X's in English. Are there any four letter words that have X? Oh, probably. Marx. Karl Marx. Guess his name has an X. What? You guys got it wrong? So you get an arm. What's your next guess? What's it gonna be? M. That's a good guess. M. A. All right, what's your next guess? Q? Come on. Q? That's a terrible guess. All right. What's your next guess? You're almost, uh, you got three more until you die. What is it? H? Nope. Better luck next time. All right, there's the body. You're almost dead. <laughs> What's your next guess? Z? Z or Z. If you're American, you're Z. If you're Canadian or British, then it's, or Australian, then it's, I think it's Australian and New Zealand. Then, then it's Z. Z. Um, you're wrong. So, there's your leg. You're almost dead. Just one more. What is it? What's your next guess? K. That's a good guess. M A blank K. Are you ready to solve the puzzle? Would you like to solve the puzzle? Or would you like another guess? What's it gonna be? You guess it wrong, you die. Or if you guess it right, you, you might. You have a one in 26. There are 26 letters in the English alphabet. So you have a one a 126 chance. Well, I guess you've already used some letters. How many have we used already? Maybe you have like one one nineteenth or one eighteenth or something like that chance. Or do you want to solve it? What's it gonna be? Oh, you want to solve it? Well, what letter do you think is in there in the blank? You got it. It's an R. R. Mark, you win! You guys win. You saved yourselves from death. Great work, guys. I'm so proud of you for being a hangman champion. Where did I, where's my X and O's board? Are you an X and O's champion? Yeah, anyway, those are just some games. Sometimes I get a bit bored here on my island alone. I mean, it's a beautiful island. I don't have any reason to get bored, but sometimes I have already visited the monkeys. I've already visited Mr. Iguana, Mr. Butterfly. There's nothing really else to do. I don't know what to do. Maybe I should try to get off my island. Should I try to explore some other countries? Let me know down in the comments if I should, uh, if I should stay on my island or if I should venture off, see if I can find some other countries. So let me know down in the comments and uh, smash like if you like X and O's, if you're an X and O or a hangman champion. 
Well, thank you guys for joining me for these games today. And uh, there's another shot of the beautiful ocean and the beautiful sun. Look at that big, bright sun. It's so bright, it's so hot. Wow, it's a blinding, blindingly bright sun. Anyway, thank you guys for joining me. Really love to have you. You're always welcome here on my island. I'm keeping an eye out for you, so anytime you want to join me, you're more than welcome. So have a great day, guys. And uh, oh, I'm squinting. I'm squinting from the bright, the bright light. So I wish you a squinting goodbye. Have a great day here. Wherever you are in your work part of the world, I'll have a great day here on the Isle of Mark. And uh, come visit me soon, okay? All right, have a great day and a safe voyage here to the Isle of Mark. All right, see you guys over in the next episode of Mad English TV. <laughs> Take care.